good evening. Lima beans are wrong. Lima beans are evil. The lima bean industry is a vile and sinister force which must be crushed to a bloody pulp. Mad Magazine. I've often joked that there are certain foods which nobody actually likes. Mad Magazine would often give the example of fruitcake. I believe lima beans are one of these foods nobody actually likes. Lima beans are nasty. Lima beans are gross. Lima beans are disgusting. How could you tolerate lima beans at all? Just because people eat them, and just because people may say they like them, is not the same as people actually like lima beans. Psychologists know there's many reasons people have for engaging behaviors they don't like. Perhaps people eat lima beans in order to impress others. Perhaps people eat them in order to be different. Perhaps people eat them to mask insecurities. Perhaps people eat lima beans in order to get attention. There's no good reason to eat lima beans Lima beans are inherently unlikable. Nevertheless, the lima bean industry tries to push lima beans on us because it wants profits more than anything else. The lima bean industry loves to tell us how lima beans are a source of iron. So what? The iron in lima beans is not that great, no matter how much the lima bean industry may boast about it. Furthermore, you don't have to eat nasty food to get iron. You can eat delicious food to get iron. Probably more delicious food. Probably food that is, which has even more iron than a lima beans. Don't believe the hype. Don't consume lima beans just with iron. It's not worth it to assault your taste buds. It is not a good idea. Sometimes the lime bean industry stoops to false advertising and fraud. Through its work with another industry, which alone is not so bad. In fact, it is good. But when it gets involved with the lime bean industry, there is evil. Have you ever eaten mixed vegetables? Vegetables are good. Mixed vegetables are a wonderful product if that's what they really are, mixed vegetable. But if you are discerning, you probably have noticed mixed vegetables contain something nasty. Lima beans. It perplexes me. Labels say mixed vegetables. What in the world are lima beans doing in there? Last I checked, lima beans were not vegetables. They were a legume, which unfortunately taints the whole family of legumes. The industry realizes since lima beans are so gross, people are going to be inclined not to eat them, that it must be sneaky trying to put these in products we like. But you have to be ever on guard. Don't eat a spoonful of vegetables to get lima beans. 
it's not worth it. Even one line of eating spoils a whole dish. Leave it out. The limey industry should be indicted for fraud. It gets a commission out of every sale of mixed vegetables. The two work hand in hand to cause damage to all of us. It is unacceptable. We need to stop the profits because the profits harm humanity. You probably noticed but besides tonight's lecture, you really don't hear or see much about lion beans out there. Some of you may be saying, see, that is proof positive that you're just paranoid. If there was discussion, then you could say the lion bean industry is powerful. But you're wrong, because there is no discussion. Au contraire, mon frère et soeur. Such is not the case. In fact, the lack of discussion is exactly what the lime industry wants. You don't read about lime in the newspaper. You don't hear about them on the radio. Presidential candidates don't debate them. You don't hear about lime beans in our schools. This should change. We should require all presidential candidates, all candidates for any office for that matter, to issue statements on Lyme beans. Schools should not only teach reading, writing, and arithmetic, but also Lyme bean studies. Radio should be required to comment on means in order to get a Federal Communications Commission license. Newspapers should be mandated to print information about libraries in order to stay operating. The libraries industry realizes that if people begin to discuss libraries, the flaws will come up. The libraries industry would rather have us not think about it, just consume libraries, Blindly, it knows if we talk about it, it's going to be deadly. Let's talk about it. Let's put the lime industry in the grave. The lime industry would like nothing more than for you to binge on lime beans. It's beyond horrible to even eat one lime bean. I cannot fathom how horrible it would be to binge on lion beans. The more lion beans you eat, the more profits the industry gets. Therefore, the industry loves you binging. But don't binge. Don't assault your taste buds. It is a crime against humanity to do that. You might get fat. You might overdose on some lethal substances. Most certainly, you may kill your taste buds. Internet experts recommend using your email account as a way to promote your cause, message, business, or whatever. I have done this. I have an email account called lionbeanpuree at email.com. I am using the my email account name in order to advance this noble crusade.